back here. So we're testing out the new build. It's a 14 foot V-hole. I haven't named it yet. It's camoed up. I have the twister from Mud Skipper on it. The Twister 4 model uh, with the 18 horsepower Duramax. We're gonna see how it goes. I have a normal amount of gear on the boat. Um, cooler, you know, batteries, all that kind of stuff. Um, so it's 111 degrees, so air-cooled motor. So it should be a good, pretty good test. I'm also doing a size 9 prop this time. When I was running it with a size 8, I was doing 3,900 RPM. So I think I can do a size 9, but we'll see right now. So no problem idling up river. Really surprised swapping the twister with the 18 horsepower onto the 14 footer. I thought it would slow down in speed, um, but it kept the exact same top speed. I do eventually want to do a V twin on this build because this boat can handle up to a 35 horsepower motor. However, this 18 horsepower single cylinder is doing really well. I highly recommend the Duramax 18 horsepower motor. So the camo on this boat was done with a tan base on the inside, green on the outside, uh, some black mixed in, and just blended in the colors and used an old fishing net as a stencil and just kept repeating the pattern until I got what I got. If I do do a deck on this boat, it's definitely going to be some aluminum framing. This hole is very deep on the inside and allows a lot of storage space. Hopefully with our videos it can come to show that you can get shallow and skinny with the V-holes. Uh, utility V-holes are perfect for mud motors. Obviously a flat bottom you can get more hyper shallow easier, but uh, this boat does not have any problems getting shallow. That's for sure. <laughs> 